As a fan of a popular show, it isn't uncommon to have to part ways with one of your favorite characters. Saying goodbye to a beloved character is not always easy, especially when they have been an integral part of the cast for years. The successful medical drama Grey's Anatomy is no stranger to this. The deaths portrayed in the show are definitely among the most shocking on-screen deaths of all time, such as... On the season finale of season 5, George O'Malley is hit by a bus and dies as a result of the accident. The next two on-screen deaths were also a tragedy. Reed Admison and Charles Percy are shot by a spree killer in season 6. Mark Sloan dies at the beginning of season 9 as a result of a plane crash that occurs at the end of season 8. He suffers life-threatening injuries and falls into a coma. Soon after, due to what he wrote in his will, his life-sustaining measures were discontinued. On the other hand, Lexi Gray was so badly injured on the plane crash that she died on sight. At the beginning of season 10, Grey's Anatomy fans were forced to say goodbye to Heather Brooks. One of the most emotional moments in the show was the death of Derek Shepard in season 11. He died in a serious car accident. His wife, Meredith Gray, was with him when his life support was shut off. Diane Pierce succumbed to the breast cancer in season 13 despite having undergone multiple treatments. Thatcher Gray was Meredith's father. The two had not been in contact for many years, not until being ill with leukemia. She visited him in the hospital where they became very close. He died of said disease. Andrew DeLuca also left the series after his dramatic death in season 17. He was stabbed by a random bystander. There were complications after doing surgery while trying to save his life. His heart stopped which made the doctors finally give 